And so Unbridled Solar, we started developing in late 2019, early 2020. You know, we want a diverse fleet that can serve us no matter what the operating conditions are. It is the largest solar project here in Kentucky. We were one of the first projects to go through the state of Kentucky permitting and siting process. We are celebrating the construction of this amazing project. And just all the hard work that went into it, celebrating with some of our community members. Henderson is a, it's a small community, but I tell you what, it, it is a close community. There's currently 320 employees working out here. That's local, that's travelers. Your travelers are you know, staying in the local communities. We'll have about 14 gigawatts of U.S. capacity. We were founded by a farmer. And here in Kentucky, there's a lot of farmland, a lot of farmers who benefit from that st stable income and, and that predictability from the revenue that they get from the land for their projects. We know that if they're successful, that's going to pour back into our own community. So we want them to be successful. We know they'll be successful. And part of almost everything we do is giving back to our local communities, that we're donating $800,000 in charitable donations. Um, and because of that, our, our uh, communities are going to benefit as well. So we serve individuals that have various disabilities or challenges. Uh, we cannot do what we do without those, those donated dollars to us. There's something about just being around a horse that people feel better. We get to support that. We are extending and expanding what that nonprofit is able to do, such as the work that Healing Reigns is doing. You know, not only saying we believe in what you're doing, but also we want to help you do it more. Give me all I've got coming to me. And they integrate with the community so well, and just it's just a genuine kind of support, and it's a, it just makes you feel good. We, we believe in putting our eggs in all the different baskets. So that way we can serve the members' power no matter what happens. You know, we're studying a lot of them that could potentially connect to our system, but this is the first large-scale one that will connect. Taking the strain off the regular producers of electricity, I think it's great. It might be the future, and I'm hoping that's what it is. Yeah, we have six other projects under development in the state. We're just excited to be a long-term company that's going to be here for a while. So now I will be